Well, these unsecured clusters of mailboxes is a treasure trove for criminals that could have credit cards for fraud or even personal information for identity theft. One homeowner was so worried that he put a camera inside to catch the criminal in the act. People who live here say it's been a problem for years. Caught red-handed, a unique mailbox camera capturing the moments a thief swiped someone's personal belongings and took off in a neighborhood near 77th and Cactus Avenues. He actually got a great shot of the person's face and hand and his sh the shirt that they were wearing. Lenny McCloskey, real easy to pull up and go, uh, is a Maricopa County constable. He too had his mail stolen before, and on Wednesday morning, he says, when this video was taken, the postal bandits made their way up and down these streets. That video is now being reviewed by police. You know, it's wrong. It's not a harmless crime because you can get medication in the mail now. You can get your Social Security checks for people who are on fixed incomes. I mean, that's devastating to them. 49 million Americans over the past year has had their mail stolen. 19% of them were in Arizona. Other neighbors here who fell victim to the felony. In fact, a couple times. Have taken steps on their own to make sure their mail stays in their box. I have a note inside that asks the person who delivers the mail to lock our box up. We reached out to USPS about the string of mail thefts. While a spokesperson says they're looking into it, they provided tips to residents such as collecting mail as soon as possible after it's delivered, placing mail in a collection box in another neighborhood, or depositing mail into a blue collection box. We got to get everybody involved to, you know, be aware. Pick your mail up every night. As Lenny looks into ways to keep his mail safe, he has a message for people who keep trying to get it. Stay away from our neighborhood. We're going to have a list of tips on how to keep your mail safe, especially during tax season, on our AZ Family News app. For now, I'm in Peoria, David Coltibiano for Arizona's Family.